my dreams coming when true. Man, stay down till I came up with my niggas. Right or wrong, fair or right, you know what's up with me, nigga. Never change on my gang, yeah, I'm stuck with my niggas. When I'm touchable, come run the money up with me, nigga. When man, stay down till I came up with my niggas. Right. Yo, what's poppin' Tupac Caddy and it's your boy. Hey, man. Supreme Caddy, man. We back in the cut with some more news updates. Now, off rip, all credit go to my boy DJ Academics, bro. Be on top of his videos, the news updates. Make sure y'all go check out my bro channel. I'll put the link in the description down below. Drop a like on this video, bro. Let's get this video to 1,000 likes. Only because all my videos are authentic. We bring that real information. I tee up with y'all boys and we go from there. Now, look. I just dropped a couple videos about my boy Young, NBA Young Boy just got locked up, you know what I'm saying? And then I dropped a video about uh, him and his girlfriend in the hotel hallway when he was when they was getting to their little squabble, bro slam there and this and that. You know what I'm saying? I dropped two updates about them. Y'all was rocking with about spitting authentic information. If you didn't see them, go watch the video so you can see what I was saying. Because I was spitting some real stuff, bro, like I say in all my videos. Now look, we got NBA Young Boy girlfriend announced that she's bringing a mixtape about the incident with NBA Young Boy. So basically she's saying... I guess somebody made a song about her, you feel me, her coming out, because she came out and was like, oh, we was just playing, and he was just pulling me. Oh, real, let me tell you, ahead of time, bro, just stop. Just just fall back, fall off the internet, leave it like it is. We Everything that already been exposed to the public, you know what I'm saying, and with the internet, you can't explain yourself to the internet. No matter what you say, it's done. You can't come out with no excuse, it's done. We seen it. It's done. Nothing you can do can explain it. You know what I'm saying? So you just coming out saying stuff is turning y'all into soldier boy, bro. Y'all some soldier boys, bro. You got to chill. You don't want to hit that level yet. You know what I'm saying? It's the last thing, bro, need. Because once you hit a soldier boy, you will never be taken serious again. And Janiel, you kind of already made yourself look crazy when you came out and was like, we was playing. You can bitch can't pull me. Can you pull me? Janiel, I'm stronger than you. When you made that video, bro, you kind of just threw a whole... Like this whole look on you, like man, now niggas just automatically think you a liar because you came on so many videos with that energy and stuff like that. You can't do that. You know what I'm saying? Like just fall back. The best response is no response. When a nigga wondering what you gonna do next, when they know you coming out doing, do you know how fake and you know how much of a liar you looked in that video? You know what I'm saying? Shorty looked like a complete liar. I bet you can't pull me. That nigga picked you up and slammed you. What pulling got to do with? You? They don't got nothing to do with pulling. You know what I'm saying? So just fall back, fall off the internet. Before I show y'all boys this song, if you agree with me, they need to just fall off the internet and stop entertaining it, because it's looking like 6 9 The more you try to explain yourself to the internet, the more you're going to look like a fool. Get this through y'all head. Ain't no explaining nothing to social media. They going to say what they want. They running with what they want. You forever, nothing. You can't explain yourself. There's no way, period. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, the reason I'm saying this, because when y'all boys hear this song, y'all finna be like, oh, Janiel, bro. Chill out, you know what I'm saying? She said she making a mixtape about the situation. Y'all listen to this song, man. Y'all boys know the enemy, so let's get it, man. Gang. He was pulling me. I was pulling her. He was pulling me. I was pulling her. That's how we like to play. That's just us. That's how we like to play. That's just us. Since y'all want to make a song about me, mixtape coming out in two days. Download it, my mixtape. Be sure to download it. Check it out now. Lost in the sauce known as clout these days. Oftentimes when people are in controversy, they don't realize when they should log off, stop tweeting, stop making videos, stop responding, and stop reacting. I mean, it's happened to the best of us, okay? Because some people will internalize actual attention as good attention and they believe online anything that people are talking about you is just clout and you could just spin it to your benefit except in this case because NBA young boy girlfriend after she got her ass whipped okay she got a severe case of the beast okay she is online not only defending her ass whipping she's saying she was playing around with young boy now Again, I'm not going to give out which sources these are, but I have spoke to people who have been around them in public as early or as late, as I should say, as like two weeks. One thing before you finish, notice how Shorty rocking her hairstyle differently to cover up her face tattoo, bro. You see this side over here, my nigga, open, period, right? You can see her whole forehead. What's going on right here, bro? You know what I'm saying? When have y'all ever seen Shorty rocking her hair like this? You know what I'm saying? And it ain't got nothing to do with them getting into it. She probably just don't like the way it looked. Because in the first video when she got it, she was like, why it look like it's all the way? You know what I'm saying? That's why she rocking her hair like that if you can't read through it. Weeks ago, 
And they said the behavior y'all saw on camera is what we saw too. And they were laughing. So again, maybe they were playing. But that just looked too rough for me, okay? And again, call me soft, but goddamn, if chicks taking that type of hits, okay? I mean, God, hold up, man. This is getting out of hand, all right? Now, she announced that she's dropping a mixtape, all right? And obviously, she's basking in the attention while also trying to deflect from the accusations that her boyfriend whips her ass, okay? She says she's dropping a mixtape, and she played some remix that was done by, I believe, Remix Sway God Salute to Him. And she says, yo, if y'all want to keep talking about me and whatever, I'm about to turn into a full-on fucking joke. Now, it concerns me that I haven't seen a sister, a brother, a mother, a aunt, a grandmother, a friend speak out on her behalf or speak to her mental state or speak to what they witnessed on camera. It feels like she's just out here by herself, which concerns me. Okay, I do think that she has been used to this behavior for so long that she probably don't see a problem with it. And also, if she don't got family around her that could say, yo, shorty, stop playing around with that because you really got your ass whipped, okay? If nobody's there to say that to her, she might just really think it's one big joke. As I said, she's in a very precarious situation. She was with him when he was broke. He's now rich. They're not married. No kids. She's trying to hang on because there's monetary benefit. And, of course, she's probably in love with him. They got matching face tattoos. Yes, she might get her ass whipped. Yes, she might be sleeping outside. Yes, she might get a fucking elbow drop. But then she goes to the Gucci store and balls out. For her, it may be worth all of that. And psychologically, she might just normalize all of that behavior. I feel bad for her. And again, if you look at this and you can't see that, man, it's either some mental brainwashing that went down or she's severely troubled. Or three, she's been abused so much that she actually think it's not abuse. It's crazy, all right? Get in the comment box, make sure you guys like them, subscribe. But would y'all copper tape, Dobra? I don't want to make fun of her because she's a victim, all right? And even if she don't know she's a victim, I'm going to treat her like a victim. Look, bro. This is what I got to say, bro. Now, look. Shorty came out, right? The video leaked. She's trying to run, right? <clears throat> Bro pulled her, pulling her back in. Bro picked her up, dropped her, did their thing. Now, we know his couple's going to do their thing. If you've seen the movie Baby Boy, you see how they go. Bro smacked her one good time. They did. They broke up for a week, back in relationship. You know what I'm saying? Some people got relationships like that. But look, when you come out on the internet and lie about it, that make y'all both look like complete liars. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing you can tell us, bro. And that was the dumbest lie I've ever heard. We was pulling me, he was pulling, I was pulling, he was pulling me, I was pulling him. My nigga, pulling ain't got nothing to do with slamming, bro. Your whole shirt came off. Bro pulled your whole shirt off. You was like this bagging up. It looked like a Grand Theft Auto scene. Bro chain was on the back of his neck. When niggas working hard, they chain on the back of their neck. You know what I'm saying? And niggas don't even notice it. You feel me? Now, <sighs> bro, then you say he finna drop a mixtape. Shorty not finna drop a mixtape. That, that song right there was from, what's the name, like um, DJ Academy said, Flunks the Remix God or whatever, he made that, said, how about that? He made that remix as well. NBA Youngboy posted on his story and said his mixtape was dropping in two days. It wasn't NBA Youngboy, it was obviously somebody from his campaign, because he just had an updated mugshot, which means he was still in jail. Somebody else just posted that and said, I'm good to the death of me or something like that. Somebody else did that from Youngboy campaign. So for the people that were saying, Youngboy out, Youngboy out, he not out. One of his campaign members did that, or she did that. You know what I'm saying? She's saying she dropped a mixtape in two days. Another thing about the mixtape in two days, we ain't believing it till we see it. You know what I'm saying? The mixtape got to drop first before any, any of us get on our toes. But as far as this young boy, bro, the best response, because I'm pretty sure, I, I know for damn sure he ain't tell her to do this. Because if you told her to do this, bro, I know he ain't tell her. I know he ain't tell her to do this, man, because you turn into Soldier Boy. You know what I'm saying? You can't. She can't be out here speaking doing this, bro. Because it's making y'all niggas look real bad. Like, the best response is no response. If a nigga dissing you and coming for your neck, fall off the earth. You come out here, I'm really about it. Bro, that's the quickest way to turn into Soldier Boy. And why I keep saying Soldier Boy is because how many of y'all going to take Soldier Boy serious if he come up here and say he finna go catch a body? Bro, nobody. We finna be like, look at this nigga again on the internet, bro. You know what I'm saying? You don't want that. When we see a Jania say, oh, uh, let's say Jania fall off, the young boy push off the building. Oh, we were just saying, huh, who can really, who got more balance? I said, you got more balance than me. We gonna be looking at this nigga back on the internet, bro. You get what I'm saying? So the best option, my nigga, is to fall off the internet. Because you look real goofy right now with that video saying, I bet you can't fool me. 
Ain't nobody going for that shit, my nigga. We done seen it. Half of us done probably seen our parents or our sisters or our mamas go through it. So we know what it look like. You know what I'm saying? That ain't got nothing to do with pulling, my nigga. And if that's how y'all play, my nigga, young boy, your music ain't fitting up to this. If that's how y'all niggas play, my nigga, we, we, we know my nigga, young boy, is this, this nigga that's a thug, you know what I'm saying? Bro gonna splat you if he got a problem with him, slap this, slap that. You know what I'm saying? We don't know the young boy that can you pull me to play with. You know what I'm saying? We ain't knowing all that shit. You know what I'm saying? Especially not slamming females. So, young boy, you got to lay low, bro. You know what I'm saying? This already affecting your image, bro. You know what I'm saying? You are, And that's a couple niggas that ain't... A couple niggas that mama didn't got beat. They didn't watch their mama get beat growing up. They used to listen to your music every day. Now they just seen young boy abuse the women. Bro, your song don't even go hard like that no more. Your female fans, you in the song, baby, come here, let me show you all. Your females that was feeling your song... Like, dang, young boy, they ain't even feeling you no more. How you gonna be her protection when you, you the one doing the, the damage? You know what I'm saying? Because I done heard some females on their stories now saying, don't free him, free G Herbo. You losing the fans already, bro. Everybody, all the females on your tip. Now they falling off. You know what I'm saying, my nigga? So this already affecting your image. So with your shorty out here dropping these dumb videos like this, you got, bro, you gotta stop. Because you it's looking like Soldier Boy in 6 9 right now. That's what it's looking like, bro. You got to fall off the face of the earth until you get your situation right. Maybe it'll die down. If you keep entertaining it, it, it ain't going to die down. Look at Famous Dex situation. You don't hear Famous Dex. Everybody ain't here not talking about how Famous Dex was beating his girl up in the hallway. He died down. Bro, shut up about it. He did his time. He came home. He shut up about it. You get what I'm saying? When she out here throwing this in the internet, and throwing, it ain't going to never die. It ain't gonna never die. It's back in our face every time we forget about it. Oh, we forgot about it. Here comes Janelle again. Damn, shut up. You know what I'm saying? So fall back. That's the best solution, bro. When you yapping over and over. And don't drop a mixtape, bro. That's the dumbest thing you could ever do. Don't ever do that. Because that song was pitiful. And it ain't even it ain't even yours. It's a remix. You know what I'm saying? So to protect y'all image, fall back. Because I rock with Young Boy Music too much for this nigga to turn it to Soldier Boy. Period. Your music go too hard, bro. You know what I'm saying? Your music ain't got nothing to do with your personality. We can mess with your music on a whole nother level, but you as a person, we ain't feeling it. You know what I'm saying? So you don't want to get that connection with your fans. You want them niggas to feel you personally. You want them niggas to feel your music. You want them niggas to feel you in every every aspect, bro, except for that gay shit. You want them niggas to feel you like, you know what I'm saying? Understand where you coming from. We can't, I say in all my videos, bro, I can relate to that. My nigga, I can't relate to that shit. I can't relate to slamming a female. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm skinny as hell. I can't relate to that. You stronger than a bitch. You pick shorty up, dropped it like that. I can't relate to that, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? And females ain't gonna be able to relate to your lovey songs. Because when you smacking hoes now, you gotta start rapping like 21. Or uh, uh, Kevin Gates. I bat a bitch in the mouth. You gotta start rapping like that. Not saying all this lovey stuff on your protection. Because what we seeing, bro, you know what I'm saying? You gotta fall off. You gotta fall off the face of the earth. Because ain't too many niggas gonna respect that, that woman shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of niggas ain't gonna respect that. But we gonna like your music. But that, ain't nobody gonna wanna come confront you. Like, oh, young boy, what's up? Let me get a picture. Hell nah, bro. Niggas gonna be listening to your song. Nigga walk right past you with your song in their headphones. Nigga be like, um, uh, already ain't hey, baby, you right here. Gets me on my sound. My... Nigga don't fuck with you. They just like your song. You don't wanna do that, bro. You wanna keep this connection, my nigga, because you was on top of the world at one point dropping hits, hits, hits. It was young boy this, young boy that. Niggas mad you ain't drop your tape. Tell your shorty fall off the internet, bro. Cause she gonna mess up y'all niggas image period you know what i'm saying just do it get your situations out hopefully you ain't got no probation violation because if you did you see what they did to me you see what they just did to symbol they they ain't playing they smacking fat cases on niggas with with that's doing good you got millions behind your name oh they smacking cases nigga then you gotta fall off or they gonna hit you with that case and go about their day on their lunch break and you just got 24 years of your life taken away you don't want that bro you know what i'm saying so chill out y'all always say y'all niggas rich why y'all niggas do the most you rich bro you got everything niggas asking for. Sit down. Like, what? What's up? You know what I'm saying? What's up, bro? Sit down. Chill out. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, man, if you rock with this video, bro, drop a like on the Let's Get This Video to 1,000 likes. If you got something to say or feel like you feel what I'm coming for or if you disagree with what I'm saying, let me know down in the comment section below, bro. We're going to have a cool conversation. Don't come in and talk crazy in the comments. But if you feel like, bro, I don't agree with you right here, let me know. I, I want to I take what y'all niggas say important. You feel me? What y'all niggas say, I feel like it's important, too. We all got to say, I want to see what y'all niggas got to say. Y'all came to this one, I got to say. So comment down below what you think about this, man. If you feel like, hey, they some little birds growing up. If you feel like, hey, that ain't cool. If you feel like, hey, you know what I'm saying? I want to know. Hit me on my social media. All links be in the description down below. Make sure you subscribe, but we on the way to 100K. Check out some of my other young boy updates and other videos. Peter, we do all type of videos. I'm not a news reporter. My bros want to see this, so I get it to it, bring it to y'all, get my point of view. We spit that real information, and we go from there, bro. Now, anyways...
Janiel, fall out the internet, bro. We can't turn to Soulja Boy. Young boy, just keep your hands off the females, bro. Do your thing, your music. You straight. Period. You know what I'm saying? It ain't gonna be that hard to bounce back when niggas know you authentic, bro. You know what I'm saying? I gotta bring up with some over there also. I know they gotta stop this video. Just get it, man. Nick, know the 50,000 on my wrist. Every nigga with me, real rich. Niggas having pressure by the bitch. I got all my cases dismissed. I don't go back and forth on the internet. Real niggas don't get into that. I'm trying to get in on my for real. I'm trying to get in on my. Me and my dogs, me and my dogs. We trying to run your house.